Alright, so Darkest Dungeon DLC, the first set ever of, of DLC has just come out. It's called Crimson Court. It's vampire themed and they're kind of like bougie. So that's kind of cool. It's, it's a little bit different take than a lot of vampires that we see in games. So I like it. Um, for those of you having trouble installing it, you, you obviously buy it. It's 10 US dollars. Um, it's out for computer, not sh uh, sure when it comes out for PlayStation. But what you do is you go to campaign here. You have to enable it if you already have a game going. So you click on enable and you gotta select each one to add it in. So Crimson Court includes a new area to adventure in. Haven't checked it out yet, I'll do videos on it later. District system is a new way to upgrade your Hamlet. So you get to like specialize in certain things. I'll show another video on that. And then we have a new class. You can choose to leave none of them enabled or enable all of them. The thing is, once you do it, it's permanent. So some of you may want to jump into your old games. Some of you may want to jump into your new games. I started a Radiant Dungeon. This is my first playthrough, like maybe a couple weeks ago I started. I'm on week 70 already. I'm probably going to beat the game. I probably shouldn't have installed the DLC, but it's too late. But I'm probably going to beat the game and then give it a run through on normal with the DLC from uh, scratch. Maybe I'll do a video series on it or something. Anyways, I hope this video was helpful to you. For those of you on PC having issues with the game, let's say you don't even have this option. Double check that you bought the right DLC. Double check that you didn't buy the soundtrack from Steam because they're the same price. If you did, Steam has a great refund tool, so you may want to do that. Also, double check that um, you have done uh, the proper install. So you may want to—I'll show you real quick—but you may want to go to your Steam. Actually, I can't show you. But once you're in Steam, you're gonna want to go to the game, right-click it, go to properties, go to local files, right? Verify integrity of game files. That should clear up any issues you have. Anyways, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed the DLC. I'll give it a shot and let you guys know my impressions and give you some tips and tricks on that as well. Alright, thank you. Have a good day.